अमेरिका के राष्ट्रपति डोनाल्ड ट्रंप ने दावा किया कि चीन की सरकार हांगकांग की सरहद वाल अपनी फौज बढ़ा रही है ट्रंप ने अजिहा दावा किया ट्रंप ने यह दावा अजि समय में किया जो हांगकोंग वे पद्धर से विरोध प्रदर्शन हो रहे हैं इन्होंने प्रदर्शन कारण उतों की अर्थव्यवस्था तो लैके उडाना तक प्रभावित हुई ने अमेरिकी राष्ट्रपति ने आख्या कि साडे इंटैलीजेंस ने सू दस है कि चीन की सरकार हांगकोंग की सरहद वाल फौज बढ़ा रही है तो सारे लोग शांत और सुरक्षित रहन इस तो पेल ट्रंप ने एक होर ट्वीट कर ये सवाल किया कि इलाके हालात उन्होंने जिम्मेवार ठहराया जा रहा है तो ट्रंप ने ट्वीट किया कि हांगकोंग जारी परेशानियों लिए कई लोग मैनू और अमेरिका को जिम्मेवार ठहरा रहे हैं मैं सोच नहीं सकता हाँ कि अजिहा क्यों डोनल्ड ट्रंप ने कहा कि हांगकोंग बहुत मुश्किल स्थिति का सामना करना पै रहा ट्रंप ने आख्या कि मैं उम्मीद करता हाँ कि यह चीन छड़ के हरेक काम करेगा मैं उम्मीद है कि शांतिपूर्ण काम करे उम्मीद है कि किसी को ठेस नहीं पहुंची होगी तो उम्मीद है कि किसी की मौत भी नहीं हुई होगी very tough we'll see what happens but i'm sure it'll work out i hope it works out for everybody including china by the way i hope it works out for everybody so this is worries about a very tricky situation i think it'll work out and i hope it works out for liberty i hope it works out for everybody including china i hope it works out peacefully hope nobody gets hurt i hope nobody gets killed we had a very good talk yesterday with china a very very productive call I think they want to do something. I think they'd like to do something dramatic. Uh, I was not sure whether or not they wanted to wait until a uh, Democrat has a chance to get in. Hopefully, that's not going to happen because the economy would go to hell in a handbasket very fast. But uh, they really would like to make a deal. The, the call itself was very productive. I'm not sure if it was the tariffs or the call, but. The call was very productive. Again, they've said this many times. They said they're going to buy farm products. So far, they've disappointed me with the truth. They haven't uh, been truthful, or let's say they've certainly delayed the decision. But it's their intention to buy a lot of farm products, and we did. We had a very good call with China. I mean, they would really like to do. As you know, they have a problem in Hong Kong, but they would like very much to do so. So we're doing this for Christmas season. Just in case some of the tariffs would have an impact on U.S. customers, which so far they've had virtually none. The only impact has been that we've collected almost 60 billion dollars from China, compliments of China. But just in case they might have an impact on people, what we've done is we've delayed it so that they won't be relevant for the Christmas shopping season.